In this video, we're going to look at just yet another integration by parts example, but it was a little bit tricky for to try to figure out what to let DV be, or, or the UPs, whichever way you want to look at it. So this one's asking us to integrate from 0 to 1, r cubed over 4 plus r squared dr. All right, so we're going to try to do this by parts. I need to be a little bit careful. I really do want, do want to let u be the piece that's going to get simpler when we differentiate it. But I don't want it just to be r cubed in this case, because then I can't anti-differentiate the 4 plus r squared to the negative 1 half. In order to be able to anti-differentiate 4 plus r squared to the negative 1 half, if you think about your u substitution, I need to let u be the inside. My du will have a 2r piece, right? So I need to take one of the powers of r and put it over with the dv, and then my u can be r squared. Now I do your integration by part, or excuse me, do the derivative of u and antiderivative for dv. Your du is 2r dr. Your v turns out to just be 4 plus r squared to the 1 half. So now when we do our integral, uv is r squared 4 plus r squared to the 1 half. We're going to evaluate that from 0 to 1. We've got a 2 here uh, for our constant, so we can pull that in for, out in front. So we get minus the integral, 2 times the integral from 0 to 1 of r times 4 plus r squared to the 1 half when we multiply v and du together. We've already done an antiderivative. Uh, we can do this antiderivative using a u substitution. It'll be 1 third 4 plus r squared to the 3 halves. So you can check that. We need to evaluate both of these from 0 to 1. So we can plug 0 in, plug 1 in, subtract as indicated, and simplify. And you get to the final answer of 16 minus 7 root 5 over 3. One thing to note, we used integration by parts on this example. However, that was unnecessary. You really could have done a u substitution here and got it that way. So if you want to think about how that would work and do a u substitution, instead of going through the integration by parts, that would be a good exercise.